August 12, Wednesday of the 19th week in Ordinary Time A reading from the Holy Gospel according to St. Matthew Jesus said to his disciples, If your brother sins against you, go and tell him his fault between you and him alone. If he listens to you, you have won over your brother. If he does not listen, take one or two others along with you, so that every fact may be established on the testimony of two or three witnesses. If he refuses to listen to them, tell the church. If he refuses to listen even to the church, then treat him as you would a Gentile or a tax collector. Amen, I say to you, whatever you bind on earth shall be bound in heaven, and whatever you loose on earth shall be loosed in heaven. Again, amen, I say to you, if two of you agree on earth about anything for which they are to pray, it shall be granted to them by my heavenly Father. For where two or three are gathered together in my name, there am I in the midst of them. The Gospel of the Lord If your brother sins, here are practical pastoral guidelines from Jesus offered to servant leaders of the church on how to settle issues and conflicts among members. The first approach is to resolve the issue between the parties involved. The dialogue must be done face to face rather than through impersonal methods like writing letters or sending messages by email or text. The personal encounter will facilitate clear communication and eliminate hearing innuendos. The next resort is to identify one or two persons who can serve as go-between and witnesses during the dialogue. If they fail, leaders of the church will have to intervene. But if the parties remain relacitrant, they ought to be set apart from the community with a fervent hope that they repent and return in the future. <laughs>